Attention, Night City residents. The world of Cyberpunk 2077 is about to get even more thrilling with the arrival of Update 2.1, scheduled for release on December 5th. This update brings a host of new gameplay elements designed to enhance your experience in the sprawling metropolis. Get ready to explore the city like never before with a fully operational metro system, experience the thrill of improved motorbike mechanics, and enjoy the game more inclusively thanks to various accessibility features. This exciting update will be available across Xbox Series X, S, PlayStation 5, and PC platforms, aligning perfectly with the launch of Cyberpunk 2077 Ultimate Edition. Join us as we delve into the details of what Update 2.1 has in store. Gear up for a deeper exploration of Cyberpunk 2077's latest enhancements with Update 2.1. Central to this update is the introduction of the NCART Metro system. This isn't just transportation, it's a whole new way to experience Night City. Glide through the sprawling urban landscape, catching breathtaking views and discovering hidden gems of the city in a more relaxed and immersive manner. Another innovative feature is Radioport, which extends your musical journey beyond the confines of vehicles. Now, the eclectic vibes of Night City's radio stations can accompany you on foot, adding a new layer to your urban exploration. But that's not all. The update invites you to deepen relationships with in-game romantic partners. Post-update, you can invite them over to V's apartment, offering new interactions and hangout options. Each of these additions enriches the fabric of Night City, promising players a variety of new experiences and locations to explore. Update 2.1 isn't just about new features, it's a significant leap forward in Cyberpunk 2077 Seconds gameplay dynamics. Prepare yourself for adrenaline-pumping action with the introduction of new chases, adding a thrilling layer of intensity to your Night City escapades. If racing is your passion, you'll be excited to hear that car races are now replayable. These aren't just one-off missions anymore. You can return to the tracks to earn more rewards and even snag discounts on the Autofixer website for your next vehicular purchase. But the excitement doesn't stop there. Boss fights, a pivotal part of any action game, have received major improvements. Take the late-game showdown with Adam Smasher, for instance. This formidable opponent now boasts a more sophisticated AI and enhanced capabilities, promising a more challenging and rewarding confrontation. And for the speed enthusiasts, Update 2.1 brings in the sleek Porsche 911 Cabriolet and a range of new motorcycles, each complemented by upgraded handling and new riding mechanics. This overhaul not only enhances the authenticity of the driving experience but also injects a fresh dose of excitement into every journey through the city. Update 2.1 goes beyond expanding gameplay, focusing keenly on enhancing the technical aspects and accessibility of Cyberpunk 2077. This update is a testament to CDPROJEKT KT Red's commitment to making Night City accessible to a wider array of gamers. A notable improvement is the introduction of a larger interface font, ensuring that navigating menus and reading in-game texts is more comfortable for all players. Inclusivity extends to gameplay as well, with features like the ability to turn off the timer in the Breach Protocol minigame. This particular change is a game-changer for players who prefer a more relaxed approach to these hacking sequences. Such accessibility options open up Cyberpunk 2077 to a broader audience, ensuring that more gamers can enjoy the rich and detailed world of Night City without barriers. What does the Night City community think about the latest changes? Let's dive into player reactions and reviews of Cyberpunk 2077 Update 2.1. The feedback has been overwhelmingly positive, with players expressing excitement over the new metro system and replayable car races, enhancing the exploratory and competitive aspects of the game. The improved motorbike mechanics have also been a hit, with many appreciating the more nuanced and enjoyable riding experience. The update's focus on accessibility has been particularly well received, as players celebrate the game becoming more inclusive and user-friendly. The enhancements in boss fights, especially the revamped Atom Smasher Showdown, have brought a fresh wave of challenge and excitement for seasoned players. Overall, the community views Update 2.1 as a significant step forward in enriching the gameplay and broadening the appeal of Cyberpunk 2077, making Night City an even more immersive and accessible world for all players. As we conclude our deep dive into Cyberpunk 2077 Update 2.1, let's recap the exciting journey that awaits in Night City. This update marks a significant milestone, introducing a fully operational metro system, enhanced motorbike mechanics, and a host of accessibility features. It's not just about new content, it's about enriching the overall gameplay experience and making Night City more accessible to a broader audience. The enhanced boss fights, replayable car races, and the addition of new vehicles like the Porsche 911 Cabriolet offer fresh challenges and exhilarating experiences. Remember, this update is free for all existing and future owners of the game, including those who pick up the Cyberpunk 2077 Ultimate Edition.
So, whether you're a seasoned resident of Night City or planning your first visit, these new features are sure to breathe new life into your cyberpunk adventures. Now, we turn to you, our fellow gamers. Hit the subscribe button to stay updated with the latest in gaming. If you've already explored the new features of Update 2.1, we're eager to hear your thoughts. Like and share this video. And drop a comment below sharing your experiences and insights on Cyberpunk 2077. Your input helps shape our community and guide future content. Let's continue to explore the ever-evolving world of gaming together.